briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The United States Court of Appeals for the Federal Circuit heard the case, Nucor Corp v's United States, in 2005. The case focused on the principle that even if people disagree with a government agency's decision, a court must accept it if it is supported by sufficient evidence and follows the law. U.S. Steel and Nucor filed a petition with the International Trade Commission to investigate the impacts of cold-rolled steel imports on the domestic steel industry. The commission found that the imports were not causing significant harm, but this decision was challenged by U.S. Steel, Nucor, and other domestic producers. The case went to court, which upheld the commission's finding that import data was relevant in assessing harm to the industry. The court then reviewed the commission's evaluation of the imports and determined that they were not causing significant harm to the domestic industry, despite some old contracts with lower pricing. Nucor argued that the commission should have considered the effects of an anti-dumping investigation as well. However, the court found the commission's assessment of both investigations sufficient. It also noted a separate investigation that found steel products being imported in large amounts and causing substantial harm to the domestic industry, leading to safeguard tariffs. Ultimately, the court upheld the commission's decision that cold-rolled steel imports did not cause material injury to the domestic industry. The commission had sufficiently considered factors such as Section 201 relief and anti-dumping investigations, and the court determined that it met the legal requirements under anti-dumping and countervailing duty statutes. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.